Yeah. So looking at this group, it does look one of the kinder European qualifying groups. Bosnia, Slovakia, Greece, Liechtenstein, Latvia, Lithuania. Pairs perhaps with Group E. No chance to cross on that left-hand side with Salihovic. Misimovic, there we are. Breakthrough time for Bosnia. I think he mishit it. Misimovic, their most capped player with the opening goal. In from Salihovic. And they celebrate. They've come in decent numbers. And the opening goal coming in the 26th minute. Well, they have begun to create chances. Salihovic miskicked in from the left. I think it's fair to say Misimovic didn't catch that cleanly either. But the key thing there, half an hour or so, and they lead by a goal to nil through this man, Misimovic. Lays it off to Pjanic, Misimovic again. Mike for Ibisevic. Here's Misimovic. And that is 2 0. And that's very easy. And he goes level now with Elvir Bolic on 22 goals for Bosnia. They celebrate again behind the goal. And Bosnia could well have the three points wrapped up already. Two for Misimovic, two for Bosnia. And Liechtenstein beginning to struggle. The weight of pressure and the weight of chances, and they were completely opened up through the middle. This was nice football involving Pjanic, Misimovic. Maybe Savic tried to get in the way, but Misimovic said, no, that's mine. And that's 2-0. Yela had no chance. Misimovic did well there. But Bosnia, as they would have anticipated, are in control of this game in terms of possession, and they've got the two goals that really settle them down. They can enjoy their night now. Misimovic, he's on a hat-trick. Drops inside the penalty area, and that's 3-0. Ibisevic, unmarked. Liechtenstein are falling apart. His 11th goal for his country. And they sent more goals, those Bosnian supporters. Well, Misimovic has scored two. And just for a change, he's created one. Defending there was poor. He got between the two central defenders, Kaufman and Stocklasser, and they just stood itself now. Lovely ball sprayed to that far side for Salihovic. Here's the cross to Zheko, and that's deflected in. That's 4 0. May well have come off Ibisevic. Zheko was going for it, and it could well have hit Ibisevic. The key thing is it's 4-0. And we've still got five and a half minutes to go until half-time. It's a lovely ball played to that far side. Ibisevic going for it. Yeah, it did, it came off Ibisevic. Kaufman was there as well, the centre-back, but the goal has been credited to Ibisevic. Bosnia win back possession, and here's Misimovic for his hat trick. Jeko rather for his first goal of the night. And it was all too easily inside that penalty area on the right hand side. Jeko found space, and Jeko finished. We had a couple of chances in the first half, those with his head. He found some space, it was a neat turn, and powered it past Yela. And that is 5-0. And another big setback for Liechtenstein at the start of this second half. Their record defeat was 11-1 against Macedonia. It's Bergmeier. And some space further forward here for Liechtenstein. And the ball in. And that's a decent save by the goalkeeper, but not the second time. Now, was he offside? Matthias Christian there, found some space in behind that Bosnian penalty area. 
he looked offside, everyone stopped. But he's got one back. Matthias Christen, the substitute, who blows a kiss to someone in the crowd. There is some spirit in this Liechtenstein team. Now let's have a look at the offside. No, that was a perfectly good run. Timed it expertly. Begovic stopped the first one. Brought his ball in. He really should have scored the first time, but Begovic couldn't get in there the second time, and then he had a look round. Not so bad. Misimovic with the corner. Another player unmarked inside that penalty area. Is that 6-1 from Dzeko? He appeals. It's away, but from behind the line, from Uri. They get poor marking in that penalty area from the corner. And now Dzeko gets his second goal of the night, the second goal of the half, and it's 6-1 to Bosnia. Very poor marking. Twice, definitely over the line. It wasn't even a great header from Dzeko. Sally Hovic with the head of bat. Dzeko almost with the side of his head or his shoulder. And the ball away from the line, but it had gone over. And on... and here he is. Forward for Dzeko. Will he save it? And Dzeko. And there's his hat trick. Very unselfish from Ibisevic, could easily have shot and scored his own hat trick. But he squared it, and after a fashion, Dzeko found the net. It wasn't the cleanest of finishes, nor was his second goal, but it found the net. And that's a hat trick for Dzeko, and 7 1 to Bosnia. The substitute, Vrancic, got it going. Oh, Ibisevic was being held there, no doubt about that. He could have shot there, but unselfishly pulled it back. It might just be worth checking that Dzeko was the man that got the touch on it. He's substitute, three of them on the park now. And here's Ibisevic, he might get his hat-trick. He does. Well, his selflessness was rewarded because a chance fell nicely to him and two hat-tricks inside a couple of minutes. First for Dzeko, and then for Rebisevic. And that is a reward for squaring it for Dzeko. 8-1 to Bosnia. And they really have opened up this inside almost at will tonight. They got a bit sloppy for a while, but again, the marking not good. Stocklass are there, and Kaufman, the two central defenders. They were either side of Ubisavic. And that's a very neat finish as well, around the goalkeeper.